Hello my lovely Capricorn, welcome, welcome to this reading. My name is Mia and we're going to find out what's coming for you this month, December 2022. Ace of Swords and Nine of Swords, end of the troubles in your heads. It's all in our heads, isn't it? Yes, indeed. No, I really hope you're doing great Capricorn. Just keep in mind, this is not one-on-one -on -one reading. This is a general reading for Capricorn. Sun, Moon and Rising like yourself. So take the messages that do resonate. And drop the rest. The cards are super, super chatty. I can't wait what we are going to get for you. Now, just keep in mind, you're very welcome to subscribe, join in, don't be a stranger. And of course, like and comment if you feel that way. There's no pressure. Anyways, Capricorn, what's coming for you this month? King of Wands, beautiful. It's the sun. It's collectively, there's a lot of signs. Uh, majority got the so many major arcanas coming through, which is like there's a major energy shift happening around this time. And this card as well is Scorpio coming through. Queen of Wands, we had the counterparts as well. King of Pentacles, ooh, real hermits as well. Virgo through as well. And two of Pentacles and Seven of Swords. Ooh, to be or not to be, there's a lot of decisions, a lot of change happening. Serious stuff, Capricorn. Mm. Oh, yeah. You are in the middle of making a certain change in your life, which part participate you participate in it and the universe as well. However, you do not know whether which is the right way to approach. Just keep one thing in mind, though. This Seven of Swords, that is not the right approach. And you're kind of making making decision. Okay, shall I shall I do this way or that way? Two of Pentacles is suggesting, and you have free will. You can do whatever you want. It's suggesting to look outside the box. There is more than one way how you can achieve what you want to achieve. Either this is meeting a person, or or finding a job, or a, starting a side hustle. You do not have to cheat life. If you cheat life. Life is going to cheat you as well. There is no nicer way to doing it. However, if you think that it could be someone around you there, be mindful who you share your money or your business ideas with. Okay? And do not give everyone, anyone permission to manage or control your life at all. Okay? No, 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 no. Not at all. This is not... I want to quickly see what this is going on. About work. And I'm like... Sorry, Capricorn, we always talk about work with you. Always. Oh, right, 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 right. So, the th story goes like this. You are building something up. You're really leveling up. You're going up the ladder at work or, or certain aspects in your life are really working out. There could be some jealousy going around. So, Keep your business to yourself. Yes, that's me. It's advice, free advice. Keep your business to yourself. However, it might be that you want to level much higher and you do not maybe know how to approach this. Do not worry about this because the universe has something in, in, in mind for you. Now, at the beginning of the month, Mercury goes into your sign, Capricorn, and it's going to stay there till 11th of February. So it is definitely how we... How we what is our image at work or places where we matter, our image matters and how we communicate and how we think as well. OK, how we speak. OK, that is very important. And that could be the key and a really good indication how to approach the situation. OK, approach the situation as you are victorious, as if you already have it, because the sun card is here for you to kind of give you a nudge kind of giving that com confidence, okay, that you maybe sometimes need, sometimes lack, and, and could be the situation where you're kind of feeling, okay, am I experienced enough? Is this something missing? No, it's nothing missing. If it feels right, just go for it, because King of Wands is someone who is will work in the area or be business in the area where they do love what they do. You will not see King of Wands in, in place where they hate doing it unless they are making building money or trying to get ends meet so they can then pursue their interests okay outside of work however together this is real a lot of fires coming through a lot of lot of a lot of a lot of fires coming through and this is what you maybe need sometimes you're very 
down to the ground and you're just doing your thing you know sometimes you need that kind of boost you know it feels like you've been not a little nudge you know go for it go for it you've been maybe looking around how to approach maybe you want a promotion you don't know how to tell it maybe you want to start an own business and you don't know how to do it there could be someone in in an area that could be actually giving you advice or it feels that you might be open door someone might have open doors for you to either to meet this person or you might actually come across on, on youtube or a book or whatever it is to kind of you know get that information that you need now what we have in the middle <laughs> oh jupiter is in aries and this is definitely regarding business and travel okay business and travel there's a little opportunity coming your way and especially now king of Wands, there is someone uh there's a people or person that is really fond of you in a way the way you do things okay and your travels are ending and it feels like you might not <clears throat> excuse me you might not know how to approach the situation but those people do it doesn't mean that you need to give your control away give your kind of your life away or or self but it kind of feels that there could be some outside um outside um energy is coming in and helping you to making that decision so there will be some door that will be closing before you better good definitely so it will narrow your kind of it will narrow your view it will narrow your kind of options and will narrow down to those that you really really need okay important very important now at the beginning of the month as well, 6th of December, we do have the full, no, 7th of December, yes, full moon in Gemini. And one sun is, and the wand is saying, I know you're busy, I know you're working, I know you really want certain things in your life, but life is for living and you need to have your joy back in your life as well. So let your hair down, this is a time for, December is a very tough time for some people. A lot of physically and, and demanding because a lot of work needs to catch up emotionally as a christmas coming holidays coming there's a lot of financial struggle maybe and people don't know how to they're gonna maybe pay the bills and on how they're gonna get the presents and there's a lot of pressure and right and emotionally as well and spiritually however however have that younger self allow the child self to come out now and then as well okay do not take yourself too seriously now coming that day end of months we are coming into your season and happy birthday if you're celebrating this time of the year this um, end of the december okay and we will have a new moon on 23rd and mercury goes in retrograde in your sign up until uh 18th of january and it's a perfect time for reflection however before that it feels like that you will actually get what you wanted you will get that either promotion you will get that acknowledgement you might actually not um get it there but it might the decision in someone's head could be made okay so it's good news it's very definitely good news i know it's a general lady but this this month for many signs it's a lot about the work a lot about the money finances and stuff and king of pentacles could be someone as well friend or person or boss even that is really on your side and assisting you and helping you to grow and they really want you to see progress which is good it could be as well that some um some certain invoices or monies are coming in you might be getting a christmas bonus or some sort of bonus coming your way as well now mercury retrograde is a good time to reflect and it's a good time to reflect either on this month or on the situation that's going on in your life it is a good time to reflect the whole year and even your life okay not just not just small things but big things as well and kind of see where do you want to go how do you want to approach the next chapter either in your life or in your current situation now let's find out capricorn don't be shy press the like button if this resonates as well and subscribe of course right what do we need to know from this beautiful ocean tarot security and this is some one thing that you are very very being careful with money you really are careful to make sure that there's enough in your account that there's enough to go around and good you you seem like you really you is i don't like the word control but you're really managing very well in the drama knight of swords we have knight of swords is it says the drama but it means it's the how you pro how you express yourself look you might have good, good communication skills one-on-one 
a lot of communication now happens on on mail and text whatever just be mindful how you what is your tone okay especially at work so your image does not get affected okay and don't be too needy that you want something but be very professional okay and sometimes lightheartedness not too much joking not too much familiar but lightheartedness <laughs> can be impersonal could help as well now illusion the moon ooh pisces so it might be that it might take a bit of time for you to get there it could be maybe it's by um pisces season okay um end of february march you might actually get there you know it might really actually materialize and that's fine as well because there's certain things you can't see and that's fine that's fine as well to take one thing at a time take one day at a time all right like moon look it's important as well what kind of moon sign we have around and this is a new moon that is coming here as well in your sign so it is your time but you might not be given the information all information for the road ahead Take one day at a time and do be your best what you can. Wheel of Fortune. So definitely the t no luck is in your side. Okay. And all the odds are in your favor. Be patient. Be patient. Oh, show the world real you. And this is, I feel that sometimes four pentacles in relationship or in the communication could be with shy. Okay. Do not be shy. You don't need to be overpowering. But bring you to the table as well. Bring you that as a person, your experience. Don't be shy in what you know and how you can do this. Okay. And this is very important. Yeah. You might be surprised. You might sometimes say something in, and later on think, why did I say that? And that could be that one thing that's going to get you the promotion, that's going to get you the better job, that's going to get, get you more goodies in your life. Let's have a look. Now, yes, indeed. And now is it now that you ask angels for help be open to receive okay and it's a good time to give birth to new um ideas and you are very protected so definitely this universe got your back big time got your back capricorn so important to have that you know uh it's like look at this two, two people here there's a wings around and it's kind of like really um an enveloping this, this this situation so fear nothing but have faith have faith in good things that's coming your way. Ask for help from others. Interesting. And this card was coming out as well. Helpful people. So this is interesting. You might actually have certain people or at work or in your life or even person you may never meet. But their advice from either YouTube or their book or whatever could be actually very, very extremely helpful. Okay. And don't be scared and don't be shy or... Put this pride aside sometimes and, and advice could be and if you ask advice for someone they might actually think oh you are not that no you are very professional you ask for advice as well you want to grow you want to learn things and that could be as a good sign most importantly yes indeed okay what we have for you no you turn and one way this is it the only way is up for you okay there's no way turning back don't question yourself don't compare yourself to others you are on your own path stick to it okay don't question if you ask 10 people different advice for 10 people you will get different 10 answers okay have faith have intuition guide you and have that feeling that you are on the right path and you're gonna get there indeed there's a lot of love and a lot of light coming your way a lot of changes helpful people Work is working out well, you know, and money is coming in, which is brilliant to see. Alrighty, my lovely Capricorn, thanks so much for being here. I'm sending you love and light. Have a brilliant December. And thanks so much for sticking around as well through this year with me. And I'll see you in the next reading. Take care.